Hi everybody, just a quick video today just showing you how you can make an improvised torch which is essential for navigating around DAISY at night if you haven't got an electric torch or a gas lamp or a row flare or something like that and they're dead dead easy to make. The only thing you need are some rags um, and then um, uh, a short stick or a long stick um, and then some way of lighting it so matches um, or a wood drill so let's go over let's find a bush first there's a bush nice bush not a tree just a bush here we go you have a nice bush now if, if you've got a knife out you know this will be a lot quicker I'm just going to use my hands just to take apart the bush so we've now got our stick then all you need to do then is navigate to some rags or some bandages or some animal fat and then you press the combine button so it's circle on the playstation uh, that would be b on the xbox and then it comes up in the screen it says craft torch hold r2 so it's right trigger on both playstation and xbox the player gets on with it and there we have on the floor our torch Oops, just so you can kind of see it and then to light it if you've got matches you would just go to your matches and hit combine and then that would then light it um, now you used to be able to go up to trees I understand and add resin but that doesn't that doesn't work anymore now these generally last but about five to ten minutes but you can add more rags to them so when I'm playing at night on a, on a public server um, and you know I haven't got a or oh, sorry at night on any sort of server just make sure you've got lots of rags with you you know never miss an opportunity to um, to cut up some rags and then so you've got them there to add to your torch um, obviously bear in mind as well they're very visible when you have one of these things one of these things burning so as I say you know if I've got matches we can just hit combine R2 now if it's raining this isn't going to work and this works with a long stick as well there we go let's put that one down Ooh, what am I doing and they magically stick themselves into the ground so that that's really cool um, so I'll tell you what I'll do now is I'll show you how to so you, you may well be happy with that and you think great so this means that normally as long as you've got a knife um, you can uh, so you can make rags you can go f get through the night at any point as long as it's not raining um, if it's raining you might struggle so you're probably happy with that however if you're thinking what happens if I haven't got any matches? Well, you, you make a wood drill. So what we're doing now is I'm just going to show you how to make a uh, a fire drill. Sorry, uh, is it called a fire drill? Um, so what we need for that is we're going to need a short stick. So let's find another bush. Um, and what I'll do is I'll use my knife this time to chop it up. So we've got short sticks, let's put that away. And then the other thing we're going to need is some bark. Now this is where you must have something like a knife because you can't take scrape bark off a tree with your hands unfortunately. Right, so there we go put a knife away let's put so that's the bark let's put the stick into our inventory and let's just combine the stick with the bark so you see I've, I've got the cursor over the over the stick and the bark in my hands it says combine and it says, it says craft fireplace we don't want that so you tap on the uh, the right trigger and it'll go to craft hand drill kit so you just press and hold that There you go, nice and fast. Let's put that in our inventory. We don't need that dark bark anymore. So let's go and get another stick from somewhere. This bush should give us a long stick, shouldn't it? There we go, we've got long stick. So let's take our long stick. Let's combine it um, again with rags, but again, it could be bandages, it could be animal fat. So let's craft a torch.
and then on the ground there's our torch and then what we do is we then combine that with that th rather odd looking thing there which is the hand drill kit so combine R2 to ignite and then we have our torch on a long stick this time have our other ones gone out oh one of them's still going so let's put that there and then say with this one we could add more rags to this if we wanted. Like, so, is he going to let me do it? Uh, which is the one that's... Oh yeah, sorry. I was trying to add... You can't add rags to the one that's lit. There we go. And then what we could do is we could then put those in our hands. There we go, and we've got all our torches lit. Now they're, they're brilliant, so as you can see, this means that again, I, I, the problem I had, you see, is I got so used to playing on the private servers, where um, I uh, it's basically daytime all the time, that I'd never had to worry really about torches and stuff. And if I was going on public servers, if it was nighttime, I, I, sometimes I would just log off, because, you know, especially if I was streaming, it doesn't look that good, does it, at night? And then I remembered I was I, th I was playing along and, and I had a uh, flare on me and the flare went out and I suddenly remember wait a minute you can make a torch and it is so easy all you got to remember the, the critical thing is obviously you need a knife and then you can use that knife to make sticks and, and make a hand drill but it's just having a have a nice supply of uh, bandages a nice supply of rags so whenever you go into a house just just cut up some um, some clothes for some rags and also. It means things like your dirty rags you can use as well. Um, and to be honest, it, it, it makes playing at night really cool and really fun because they're, they're quite eerie when you're running around with, with, with a torch at, at night. But as I say, a final warning is the fact that, you know, watch out because, um, it, you know, people will see you coming from a, uh, a long way away um, when, you, when you've got one of these in your hand. So if you're in a in a dangerous situation, um, you probably uh, you probably shouldn't be running around with like this uh, automatic targeting system right next to your head. So there we go. That, my friends, is how you make an improvised torch. Hopefully that's useful. Hopefully that will get you out in the night. And uh, I'll see you again soon.